so good here, and I am here in the back end of the bee cave. What am I doing here? Well, I need more element. What's being in the bee cave have to do with getting element? Well, I need element ore. And down in the water here is the one place where you can get element ore. As you see, I got my basilis, my whale here, basilosaurus, and I got my anklo heavy. Well, put scuba gear on here. I am going to ride my anklo underwater to harvest the uh, element ore that's down here. Now, I've actually been prepping for this for a while. I've put quite a bit into his oxygen. So hopefully I got enough into it to get him down there. Okay, show my basilisaurus. source. Unfortunately, I haven't really put a lot into the weight for my uh, whale. Is he falling? Yep, there he's falling. Okay. Now, my auction doesn't seem to be going much on my anklo, because like I said, I've known that the uh, element ore has been down here for a while, so last bit I've been putting uh, his points into oxygen, so drop down here. Let's keep an eye on his oxygen. Down and down. And that's a little spot there where you change scenes or whatever in the game. So we're down the lower part. Now it's just a matter of finding some of this element ore down here. Now, when I came down for the artifact, it was of the deep, I think, was down here. Uh, get some element with ore with pickaxe, but. An anklo is a pickaxe, just better. So, I keep going down. As you can tell, my oxygen really hasn't gone down at all. Okay. Down the bottom here. Stamina's going down a little bit, though. Here we are, the purple rocks down at the bottom here. Uh, mist, sweet mist, sweet mist again. You guys don't work the greatest underwater. There we go. 359 element ore. This is well worth bringing them down here. Get metal, stone I really could care less about. There's easier places to get stone metal too, but. Start getting encumbered. Uh, I get very encumbered. Uh, okay, stamina is off. Okay. Up off. That's why I brought the basil source. That's, just, uh, that's not what I want. More than enough, 600. Access. Right over here. Okay. Access. Okay, oxygen is starting to cut down. Almost a half. At all, I don't need that. Make it quicker. Uh, I'm not gonna get all the element into my basilisk, and I'll lose the metal. Uh, covered. Dumbass. I am. Okay. Okay. Transfer all, make this quicker. Okay, 
he's pretty much maxed out weight. Go on. Let me do this quicker this way. I don't need the stone. Get the stones going. Pretty much a max weight. Oh yeah, we gotta get out of here. For uh, we drowned. My ankle. Am I gonna make it up out of here? Eddie? Should make it. Didn't take much oxygen to get up down here, so we should be pretty, pretty fine. I oh, yeah, my basilisk following me. Or basilosaurus. Not a basilisk, that's a snake. Duh. Okay. So we'd be climbing better when we did going down. Uh, yep, he's still there. She. That whale is a female. Yeah, we're good. Should make it. Yeah, more than enough ore. Uh, I don't think oxygen are out. Hopefully stamina does run out. Well, that would really suck. Okay, I can see the, the reflection on top of the water. And we are out of stamina. So we're up. Okay. Just gotta get up on the shore here. Where is the shore? Okay, there's shore there. Shore of the shore. Yep. Surfers over there. So. Where is it? Okay. Grab my ankle here. Heavy. I'm going to leave my Basilosaurus there because I haven't got it all. Pretty much a max weight. Head back to my base. Get some other stuff to make some more element. Make the element. Thing. This is going to take a while. Okay. So we got my ankle back at base. And I'm over here in the little creeks behind the green obelisk. Looking for uh, the baryonyx. Uh, want that one. Uh, okay. You see a gas collector down the water. This is where the gas is. Congelled gas balls to make element. Mix that with your ore and some other stuff. So I just need to go here and grab some of my uh, ore. I put these down a while back because, well, we need them. Get them sorted out. Guess something bad happens. There's a couple of Baryonics around, but hopefully they won't notice me. Access. Access. As you see, these have been here for a while because they're clear full. Need oxygen. Should have my scuba gear. I left that back at base. Very honest. And I'm knocked underwater. Stunt. Ow. Ow. This is not good. I'm gonna come off that. Keep stunning me. We're drowned. Get knocked out. Eaten. Drowned. It's not good. Not good. Okay. Get away from this fire. Okay. What? Broke my helmet. Oh, I broke you. Half dead. Okay, you got air. Air, air. Almost dead. Okay. Okay. I am going back to Surfer because 
I do not want to die here. Again. I die in these waters a lot. Usually from the gas. Let's see, I have... That was smart. I brought a health potion this time. Mostly because I thought I was gonna get killed by the gas. No. Okay. We are here at one of these little nodes. Now, as you can see, I already have everything I need in here. I got element, and I have these little batteries that you have to put in charged. I got some more of the gas balls, because that's what I was short on. As you see, it takes a few minutes to make some element. Put some more gas balls in. Now, this is the little node by the green obelisk, which I have dinos over here by, so... It doesn't seem to glitch. One of the other ones I go to seem to glitch on me. As you see, I made 30 element, or 3 element. So, I'm gonna have to do this quite a few times. Go over to another one over here. Okay. Now this is a different one. I have no dinos over here, but you see there's a little building here. Why is there a little building, building here? Well, I keep all my stuff in here. Why don't I keep it in the node? Well, I have an issue. And I can't access my stuff because my flavoring's head's in it. Okay. So, I've been having an issue. I so, have my charged batteries, gel, and my uh, gems. Now, like I said, I was, I was having an issue. I'd make an element, fly away, and when I come back, after I the thing, the uh, node charges. As you see, it's charging the batteries. Get the element made up here. Now, I'm not leaving anything in here because, as I was saying, I was leaving stuff in and flying away and waiting to come back when it's charged and everything be gone. I did a few tests, and I come to realize when I get so far away from the nodes, everything vanishes out of them. Now, the green one, the one at the green obelisk doesn't do this, but I also have dinos pretty much on top of it. So, I can literally fly a certain distance away from this, go back, and it'll be all reset. Which is making it a little faster to make this stuff. Okay. I finally got enough element to make my tech replicator. Everything in here, here we go. One tech ripper here. Had just enough stuff in there for it. Boom. Finally, I got my tech replicator. It's been a thrashing time doing this. So, where do I want to put it? Here's a good spot. I don't know. That way, this way. Or should I put it over in the corner here? Or out of the way? Mm. Nah, I'm gonna put it over here. Mm -hmm. I'll just stick it here. Try to center it up a little bit. Or square it up. Yeah. It don't matter. It's just sticking off the back. You can build it out if not. Oh, nope, I actually did good there. Okay. Let's take a look in this and see what I need to build stuff. Uh, tech pants don't need those yet. It's scout. Yeah, I get stuff for that. But I don't. Uh, I get the stuff for that. I don't need element for that. I can make element using those shards. I got a hundred. Oh, I'll make it faster to make some element. Uh, I am going to need a lot more element, which means a lot more thrashing. Okay, well, I got more thrashing to do. Hope you enjoyed the video. Well, if you made it this far, it means you watched my entire video. And if you found it useful, helpful, or funny, leave a like or a comment. Don't forget to subscribe if you uh, wouldn't mind seeing future content. And thank you very much, and uh, have a good day.